Hey everyone, I am Holly and I speak whatever's on my mind. <laughs> so I rarely listen to the radio for many reasons and I just happen to turn it on just to see. Sometimes it's a message from spirit, sometimes it's just the radio. And so I turned it on and it was at the end of a track. And the lyrics were, I'd rather be in hell than alone. And this automatically triggered something inside me. And I wanted to speak a little bit about how we are programmed subliminal, subliminally, subconsciously, some is more in our face than others. And so I looked up the lyrics to this track and it makes me wonder why they wanted to eliminate Baby It's Cold Outside off of the radio as opposed to a lot of other tracks that program our minds and our bodies. We all know the secret, the law of attraction, and how whatever you focus on comes to fruition. So when you hear tracks like this, you wonder how they even got published. And then you think of the agenda behind it. Because why would this be allowed to play on a station that children listen to. So this track, I won't get into the whole thing. You can look it up online, Kill Bill. Literally speaking on killing her ex-boyfriend because he's with someone new and she'd rather be in jail than alone. And the last line is, I'd rather be in hell than alone. So I wanted to speak on that one line. If you don't have a connection to divine source energy, to the God within you, the living God, this could set you off, especially if you've been hurt by a man before or a woman. There are little Jeffrey Dahmer's growing up right now, little eight-year-old children that are molesting and it's disgusting what's happening right now. And then music like this comes out. And if you are already in that mind state that you owe violence to others for what they've done to you, or that you want to seek revenge. The greatest revenge is your silence and you walking away and working on yourself. So figure out your purpose, your connection to the living God within you nature nature is the living god go outside and release your worries your fears your struggles into nature unless you have a connection with divine source energy and the universe these tracks and this music that they put out I pray that you have discernment to see through their tactics, their fear tactics, the fear mongering, the subliminal programming, the subconscious intake that you have in everyday life by every single verbiage and word and spell cast that happens against you. The English language is just babble. 
it's it's horrendous <laughs> so again know your connection to the living god within you're never alone you are never alone and there are resources out there that you can reach out to people if you need to talk kids help phone went crazy in 2020 they had I believe it was around 1.9 million phone calls in 2019 and it it doubled to 4 million phone calls in 2020. They were scrambling just to try and find people to answer the phone. Because of this fear mongering and the tactics that they have against us, literally we are an experiment. And unless you can discern your truth, then you may always feel alone. Find that connection. There's so many videos out there that can help. Again though, there is false information on both sides. So when you can learn to be by yourself and sit in silence and self-care routines, that, that is going to be your greatest asset. So please be conscious of what you program your mind with and program every single cell within your body the vibration and the energetic reverberance throughout your entire being into your auric field is programmed by every single thing that you hear. So choose wisely on who you have in your area, what plays in the background, and just live with love, be happy, find your peace. Mwah. Blessings to you all.